don't think I'll ever forget going to my first party. Anarchist bookshop. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Mile in Road. Yeah. No, you know, taking my first drugs and, you know, hearing the music and feeling that vibe for the first time, you know, I'll never forget that, you know, and I never wanted that night to be over and I felt that it was all going to be taken from me before. I couldn't have enough quick enough, do you know what I mean? And just that feeling that just fueled that, that whole movement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you see, it's lots of things. So many, so many parties, you know, going to so many, for me, you know, just going to so many parties in the early days. You know, I mean, even before like the, the dance scene, I was going to house parties and stuff. You know, and um, for me, that was a, that was a, such a turning point. You know, what I mean? and um, you know, listening, going to like press that, and I used to go to Soul Week and just press that, and hearing like you say, no French Kiss, you know, Lil Lou in those tracks. You know, they really still, still, still stick in my head even now. Do you know? What I mean? Yeah. I, yeah, I mean, I I was kind of like I wasn't really I wasn't really into acid house, and I was into hip hop and that those years. Yeah. You know what I mean? So I was kind of I missed out on all that. But um, those records still got played later on when I was when I was going out. I kind of I come in sort of halfway through 1989, so I caught the, that kind of summer of love thing. But I was still really into hip hop, and I was kind of just in a conversion zone then. Do you know what I mean? So, but Rain Dance, um, East London Rain Dance, the original. London warehouse kind of sound, do you know what I mean? Um, when we played, when we first played that, that was basically like when we were, I thought, yeah, we've, we've fucking arrived now, we've made it, do you know what I mean? That, that's all we wanted to do as a band, do you know what I mean? We, we just kind of wanted to just play at those parties that we were going to, do you know what I mean? So when we arrived at Rain Dots to do the gig, we just could, we were like little kids, oh, I can't believe we're doing this. I mean, yeah, yeah, so exciting. It was our ticket to the parties, really. And it was at a time when yeah. the music was kind of, I was trying to think of some tunes that were around at that time. It was, it was kind of probably, uh, yeah, first half of 1991, so it'll be like um, possibly Joe Belcham, Energy Flash, that kind of era, do you know what I mean? And that was, that was my tune, Energy Flash. As soon as that come on, it was like an anthem, do you know what I mean? Around that time, the beats, the beats had changed as well, do you know what I mean? They're more like... You know, yeah, got, the breaks were starting more to come breaks, in. More breaks, that was a, that was definitely more of a London thing though, because yeah. when we when we travelled up like towards the, like going up a bit further north, you know, um, especially kind of more maybe north of Manchester, it, it, you didn't really get so many breaks. It was more of a I felt more of a London sort of pirate radio scene that was going on. Do you know what I mean? Which we were really into, you know. Mm.